All right, I'll start with a quote here. Just chaos, total devastation, and lots of dead fish. Now, that is how one guest of the Radisson Blue Hotel in central Berlin described the situation after a huge aquarium that you can see behind me here in the hotel lobby burst early on Friday morning. About 300 guests were evacuated from the hotel. Two people were injured by flying shards of glass and some 1,500 tropical fish died. Now, the course of the incident is still being investigated. This giant aquarium in a hotel was home to around 1,500 tropical fish and a popular destination among tourists. The guests at the hotel woke up Friday morning to the sound of a loud bang. The beloved aquarium had shattered. It sounded almost like a firework, but the hotel actually shook inside. Uh, I, I could describe it as a and I jolted out of bed and turned around and I, I didn't see any movement so I didn't know what the heck was going on. The tank with one million liters of water shattered quickly. A large cylindrical tank in the building behind me burst. There was a massive water leakage, which also caused damage to the building. The pressure sent debris from the building flying into the street. Rescue teams arrived and hotel guests were evacuated. We heard a loud bang at about five or six, but didn't think anything of it at the time. A little while later, we got out of the room and looked. All the elevators went down and the lobby was completely destroyed. Due to the abrupt leak, a large number of fish couldn't be saved. The elevator ride with views of the tank is now only a memory. And for more on this, we can talk now to Sandra Wieser. She's a German lawmaker who was staying in the hotel when the aquarium burst. Thanks so much for joining us here on DW. Can you describe um, for us what it was like to be in the hotel when the aquarium burst? Yeah, actually, I, I was not really aware of what has happened because um, I heard a loud bang uh, when during I was still asleep. And uh, then I, the, the, the whole building was trembling and I thought it's a, a small earthquake or something. And I just, I was there, I was listening, but nothing else. It was a large silence, nobody screamed and so on. And then I said, oh, maybe it's a bad dream or something. And actually I fell back to sleep. And when my alarm clock was running half an hour later, I looked out of uh, my window and then I saw there were a lot of firefighters and police who blocked the main road. And then I said, OK, maybe there was something. And then I started uh, to look in the Internet or to uh, look in the television. And there were already the message that there was uh, the aquarium who burst. And uh, so I tried to reach the lobby, but uh, the telephone was out of order. And uh, yeah, actually there was no lobby anymore. That's what I saw a little bit later. And I decided to, to dress up to, to get my, my luggage and, and to try to get out of the hotel. And I was just in front of my door. And then three men, three firefighters came in by a main key and they said, OK, you have to get out of here. We're evacuating the, um, the hotel. And how were and you then, able to get out? I mean, were you able to sort of then go the, 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 the normal way out or did you have to sort of climb out of a fire escape? Exactly. We, we took the fire escape, the stairways, uh, followed by, by the firefighters. And uh, in the main lobby on the ground floor, there was water until uh, the angles. Uh, there was uh, a lot of dead fish, uh, partly frozen or really uh, in between the debris. I wanted was, to ask uh, you about the really fish very, because there were, there were 1,500 fish in that tank, weren't there? So, exactly. I mean, were they, were they lying around? Did they... Did they uh, were they washed away? I mean, what did it look like? Uh, but uh, actually, they, they were lying around. They, they were stuck uh, in between the debris, uh, the, these nice uh, parrotfish, the, the large ones. And, and it's really a pity when I remember what is it was such a nice 
the image or, or view to have this aquarium in the middle of this hotel. And, and now you see it's, it's a great disaster. Sandra Visa, thank you so much for describing to us what it was like when that huge aquarium exploded in the hotel that you were staying I, in. Thanks, thanks for speaking to us. You're welcome.